Motherfucker, Sarah Fox, pissed off bitch. Car stolen, clothes stolen, shoes stolen, missing children, or just fucking name it. Maybe it's not. I don't think it's Car, oh, definitely. Too small to be mine. And it's not a 4 by 4 And you don't have duckies on your dash. You got a giraffe ducky. I don't think that's mine, girl. So this is what the back looks like. In case anyone's missing Mary Lynch. Uh, maybe... 7.24. Is that July? Oh, you know, she's a Leah. Maybe she's end of July. Or she had a kid or something. So now we're looking for the fat lady running around in my shoes. Who looks like she could belong to Colleen Sabache or Loretta Seabolt Lane. Loretta and Seabolt Lane. Loretta was born October 23, I think 86 or so. She's got kind of a truck driver's body. This person running around in my fucking shoes was shorter than Loretta, but the same body. Right. Tight. Because Melinda was telling me. This is Just checking out people's shoes, wondering why they have to copy every fucking thing I do. Yeah. Yeah, well, we've been talking about this. Praying to God to kill these Nazi scumbags. Here's Tweed recording. I already gave them my briefy brief. I wonder if that's Leona Lewis's, uh, you know, husband or brother. Or something. Oh, not my shoes. Not my shoes. <clears throat> so that's kind of Loretta's body. That kind of looks like her, but she's not wearing my shoes anymore, and she has longer hair than the other girl. Find that bitch. She was wearing a white short sleeve t shirt with reddish, sort of dressy shorts, sort of a purplish reddish color. And my fucking shoes, except the shoes were obviously too big for her, and she's too fat to fit in my clothes. who stole my shoes and my clothes and my car and my children and the fucking bitches institute the FBI there's a car coming I'm stopping slash the Federal Bureau of Intimidation refuses to help look at all the people walking behind me it looks like Aaron Dealing again with under male back there with the whitish hair. Look, spelled it.
So this is what I look like again. Oh look, there's another dumbass idiot. Poser wannabe fraud. Like, what's wrong with you people? Did you not think to get one before I got one? And then you had to steal mine. I don't appreciate it. Excuse me, I'm just gonna stop right here for a minute. Downtown Athens, Georgia, wondering who's stalking me. Ex-detective with the FBI. That dress used to belong to the hope that I was raised to believe was my older sister, Erin. E-R-I and Erin. There they go, must be Erin's friends. So, Bobbin, where's my car? I'm just looking for my car. Who's Bobbin? Robert Michael Hodes Jr. Robin Rogers, I just call them Bobbin. They're always together. They're married. They're two men. Bobbin, sometimes they look like men, sometimes they look like women, and there's that Jeep again. Hello, Jeep. Who knows? Funnily enough, one has a vagina, one does not. One was a male hermaphrodite who cut his wee-wee off. I think Robin was jealous he still had a penis. Robin... <coughs> Had his uh, penolectomy castration because he's a rapist. And I guess he just couldn't take the jealousy of his husband having a penis. So instead of leaving him and keeping his penis, Robert decided to cut his penis off. He's looking for my shoes. Yes, ideal. Oh, this is deep. T A R A T R. Look, there's another Jeepy Jeep. I don't see any of my shoes out here. Oh, hell yeah. I don't see any bobbins out here. That looks like William Musack, little brother of Alex Musack, Loretta's you know, friend from Slidell, Louisiana. Not my shoes, my shoes. I haven't seen any sacks. Alex is running around here too, probably with Loretta. Just trying to find that motherfucker. Running around in my shoes. But look. Oh, that looks like a Jeep, but it's not a GPT. Oh, sweet. Nice guys, you guys, right? All right. Okay. I'm gonna go there so I got to do that. No. You're not a warrior, so I'm like... You're not going, 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 going. All right. Off you go. I don't want to be hard 
Ex detective with the FBI, top of my class at Quantico 1989. High school age, mind you, because I'm a fucking prodigy, you retards. I told you how old I was. I told you to leave me alone. I told you I didn't want to have sex with you, Jack Smith. Well, there's a newer Model G, but it says Marietta, which makes me a little curious as to why it's here. And you got your little rosary bees. Is that Tita's new car? <laughs> Who knows? I'm just going to stop here. Um. <laughs> no shoes of mine on those girls. All right. Let's see. Cobb. Well, that could be Chuck. Who knows? Ed Boyles. Looks like it's someone with a fucking kid or a juvenile delinquent. I still don't see my little car car out there. So the clock says 620 something. I'm guessing it's 620 something. the Carter girl was like arrested for unlawful carnal knowledge of a minor named me. But she has a fucking job. back to my stuff. No car. Oh, love the fro girl. Rock on, rock on. <laughs> Is that a GPG stocking me? I got, they, they moved on to the Broncos now because I said maybe I should have bought a Bronco. I got shoes around this bitch. No shoes of mine on y'all. All right. Don't know this guy, but I can recognize. He actually looks familiar, though. Die, Nazi, scum, die. Boycott, Hilton, RCA, Penguin, Publishing, Scholastic, Amazon, Apple, Steven Spielberg, and you may as well sue the living bejesus out of anyone on the fearlessstrikers.com website because I do not operate the website. It was taken over by the Nazi scum. <sighs> Please do them personally because I have obviously no money left. T A R A Tara, L E A Lee, S E A B O L T F O X, Tara Fox. July 10, 1974, 5'6, white female.